Today we gathered here for the launch of the Ubuntu Hub City. We launched it for English-speaking, French-speaking, uh, uh, and uh, West Africans to get a hub whereby temporary relocation, medium-term, long-term relocation will be available. Uh, this concept of housing ourselves in our own continent is a cherished dream of the African uh, fathers. This initiative is very important for human rights defenders where their life is at risk from either armed groups in their countries or from the, the government in their countries. Uh, they receive threats, uh, even sometimes deadly threats from uh, the army groups working there because they are reporting something they don't need to be reported. It's very exciting that we are here today uh, in Ghana to launch the Accra Hub City. Uh, the Hub City is uh, meant for human rights defenders uh, who are at risk in their own countries. This Hub City will offer an opportunity for human rights defenders to stay safe but not silent. At the heart of our human rights defenders protection efforts is the clarion call to ensure that we build enough and sufficient resilience, which is the ability to bend without breaking. And we do so in a more concrete and practical way by creating the Ubuntu hub cities uh, spaces. And these are safe spaces to ensure that human rights defenders, especially the most vulnerable, the least connected, are safe but not silent. And uh, the safe space is the oxygen for citizen voices, for human rights defenders to be able to carry on with their legitimate work of defending human rights. As somebody working closely on this, I've seen how it's been helpful when you take the NSAS protests that happen in Nigeria. These are innocent people that are telling the government, enough of police brutality, enough of the killings, enough of us. People are dying unjustly. We need justice. And yet their lives were threatened. Their lives were on, on, on I mean, their families and, and everything, their livelihood, everything was on, on threatened. And their voices were about to be shut. But because of Ubuntu Hub City, they were relocated. They got the assistance they need. Because as, an, as, an, as a defender, you also go through a lot as a human being. And for, for the Ubuntu Hub City, providing them with all the socio services that they deserve, the support that they need to be able to continually demand justice and, and speak out for the vulnerable is very crucial. Uh, cette initiative vient renforcer les mécanismes existants sur le continent, mais c'est également un mécanisme double uh, sur uh, la terre uh, ouest africaine. Nous avons une initiative à Abidjan. Uh, cette initiative vient donc compléter uh, l'initiative francophone qui a été déjà mis sur pied. Donc, euh, nous vous estimons très heureux de cette initiative et nous voyons que, euh, avec l'expérience, il y a eu euh, par le passé euh, une opportunité de berger ici sur la terre euh, du Ghana, des défenseurs à risque et beaucoup plus dans les temps anciens. Il y a eu également des opportunités pour héberger euh, des politiciens, des panafricanistes. Le continent développe pour assister à youth their upcoming aspirations and dreams. And therefore, it's very, very important for us to acknowledge the role they play as human rights defenders. And in any situation that they find themselves that their life feels threatened, it is the responsibility of Africa as a whole, as a continent, to ensure they have a, a haven in order to uh, protect them, promote the work they do, so that their voices will not go silent. Uh, nous sommes heureux d'être ici pour le lancement de la uh, Hub City du Dakra, qui est la septième uh, cité haute des défenseurs des droits uh, humains uh, en danger. Ils sont relocalisés sur le continent africain dans le cadre de l'initiative Ubuntu Hub City. Uh, C'est un projet très important qui permet uh, aux défenseurs des droits de l'homme d'être en sécurité, d'être délocalisés pour pouvoir poursuivre leur mission, leur militantisme et euh, tout le travail qu'ils font dans leur pays pour la promotion des droits de l'homme. Euh, qu'ils soient dans leur climat, 
qu'ils soient dans leur tradition, qu'ils ne soient pas très loin de leur pays, de leurs origines. Congratulations, people of Accra, people of Ghana, and uh, we are very grateful that hosting these resilient human rights defenders from across the continent will go a long way in making our continent the place where we want. So this is an exciting opportunity for human rights defenders coming from West Africa because they will have a place where they can call home for some time and not be silent but continue with their activism. So we're very excited to be here today and we'll continue to support the work of human rights defenders at risk. Thank you.